Hello. In this video, we will see the structure of the cell nucleus. Let's get started. A cell has many organelles. Among them, nucleus is the control center. It contains genetic information. The expression of different genes in different tissues gives them their characteristic properties. We will study the structure of nucleus under two headings, the nuclear envelope and the content of the nucleus. First, let's see the nuclear envelope. As per the name, it covers the nucleus. It is made up of double layers, an outer membrane and an inner membrane. The outer membrane contains ribosomes. And this membrane is continuous with the membrane of rough endoplasmic reticulum. The space in between the two membranes of the double layer is continuous with the lumen of the rough endoplasmic reticulum. The inner membrane is smooth. The inner and outer membrane meets at nuclear pores. The pores provide a pathway between cytoplasm and the nuclear interior. This is the path for RNAs to exit and for signal molecules to enter the nucleus. These pores are lined by nuclear pore complexes. They are complexes of proteins. They provide selectivity to what can pass through the pore and what cannot. To pass through, the protein must have a ticket. This ticket is called nuclear localization sequence. Under the resting condition, the pore complex forms a narrow channel. The diameter of this channel is about 9 nanometers. It prevents the passage of proteins larger than 60 kilodalton. But when a protein with ticket comes, it dilates. This allows the passage of protein. The pore complex also serves another function. In the video on membrane proteins, we have seen that membrane proteins can diffuse along the membrane. The pore complex restricts this diffusion. So proteins on the outer membrane remains on the outer membrane and proteins on the inner membrane remains on the inner membrane. So this was nuclear envelope. Now let's see the content of the nucleus. The substance of the nucleus is called nucleoplasm. It's equivalent to cytoplasm outside the nucleus. You already know the most important content of the nucleus. Yes, it's the DNA. During routine life of the cell, the DNA is spread throughout the nucleus in form of chromatin. It's like tangled threads. They take the form of chromosomes when the cell is dividing. Now the nucleolus. It is an accumulation of RNA and proteins of the types found in ribosomes. There can be one or more such nucleoli in the nucleus. Finally, the nuclear lamina. It is a fibrillar protein skeleton near the inner nuclear membrane. It provides structural support to the nuclear membrane. This was all about the structure of nucleus. Let's have a quick summary. The nucleus is the control center of the cell. Its envelope is a double layer. Both layers meet at nuclear pores. The pores are lined by nuclear pore complexes. They provide the selectivity to the pores. Inside the nucleus, we have DNA spread in form of chromatin, nucleoli which are accumulation of RNA and proteins, and nuclear lamina providing the support to the nuclear envelope. Substance of the nucleus is called nucleoplasm. That's it for this video. If you feel this video will help your friends and colleagues, please share it with them too. And don't forget to subscribe because lots more to come. At Nonstop Neuron, Learning medical concepts is as easy as watching cartoons. Thanks for watching. See you in next video.